Good afternoon, everyone. This is Christy with Van Allen Company. It's Monday, January 29th. I'm going to go over the markets with you for the day here. Uh, it started off with a lot of support around this grain complex. Uh, you got some technical closes, came in here over the weekend. And uh, though you have some rain in Argentina, the biggest story is that it's going to get really hot here this week. And that's been enough to really drive these beans up. So at one point had beans up about 12 cents, uh, settled closer down to like five cents higher. Uh, so you had a wide range in trade, really struggling to get much above $10 on that front contract here. Didn't get it today. Saw that selling pressure about 9.98. Uh, to 9.99 and that's where you fell off a little bit um, at one point only up about a penny but came back uh, the corn market up about two cents and then wheat market a little bit of difference between chicago and kansas city and minneapolis so chicago kansas city lots of support there but minneapolis really couldn't muster it up closing down about a penny on the day steady to a penny lower and struggles there as you really have the problems in minneapolis but you're holding quite a bit of premium above the other wheats um, with that already built in. You do have a lot of attention coming for this cold weather coming for Kansas City wheat, um, the winter wheat area, as they don't have a whole lot of snowfall cover. So that's gonna be a big story here. It's supposed to hit the first part of February and we'll see how that goes. Meat markets, pretty quiet, slight support into the cattle complex. Really thought maybe you'd see more coming out of there as cash trade was about $4 higher last week at the end of the week. Um, but you did get a slightly bearish cattle on feed, so I guess it weighed itself out. Live cattle up about a buck, feeders up slightly, lean hogs about steady on the day. Outside markets, not all that favorable. They were extremely favorable last week, so seeing a little bit of a flip of it. Dollar up about 40 cents, crude and the Dow both a little bit lower. I do have to close with a disclaimer, trading in futures and options involves risk loss. May not be suitable for all producers. Have a great day.